Please go spend them watching a skincare product. Today's video, as you guys can tell from the title, is Kourtney Kardashian's skincare routine. I'm actually really, really wanting to see her skincare routine just because she's like the most organic, natural Kardashian, if I do say so myself. She could have work done, who knows, every celebrity has work done, but I think that her skincare routine would be a lot more relatable, or at least a lot more honest than the rest of her sisters. I don't know, let's see. Give me a second. All right, secure the bag. Time is money, you come with me. Okay, so I have combination skin and my skincare routine is a one, two, three, four, five, six, seven step process. Okay, wait, actually it's an eight step process because my first step is putting on our Poosh and Aquas hair turban because I use this as basically as a headband instead of a headband. If I don't wanna wash my hair and I put it on the silk side, which is the leopard side, even if I wanna take a shower when I get home or take a bath, it's nice to wrap it up in this and it protects my hair and keeps my hairstyle for the next day. First of all, can I say the head wrapping? We don't use that, black girls. We use the, uh, you know, the satin wrap, the sa satin, like, almost like a net. That's what I use. So I can't relate to this one, but it just looks really cozy, I'm sure, to keep your hair looking silky, but um, I just don't have that. I have the regular, you know, satin bonnet. Uh, satin bonnet is what they're called. That's what almost every black girl has, so. But it's cute. It's cute. Let's continue. Solar cleansing water. I think there's a lot of different brands out there, so I've tried a bunch, and they're all the same. So after a long day of working, filming, um, you know, running around all day, it's so nice to just get my makeup off. I love how she acknowledged that micellar water is all the same. Honestly, I think that every other thing that you see out there that's not the OG micellar water is literally a seal's pitch. That's just my opinion about it. If you find $2 micellar water in the drugstore, it'll serve the purpose. Don't ever spend, I don't know, $10 on micellar water. It's really shouldn't be that expensive. Truly. Our Calm Hydrating Gel Cleanser, which has recently become my favorite face cleanser. We did it as a push pick of the week and it's very, um, it doesn't strip your skin, which I've found many face cleansers can strip and leave my skin feeling really dry. So this does not, but it definitely makes my skin feel really clean and, you know, gets my makeup off. Just me, or is she barely even washing her face? Like, I feel like she's just padding, which, I mean, I guess it is a video, I get it. But um, I feel like she's really not doing anything, but I love that she's mentioned that this cleanser doesn't strip her skin. She mentioned she has combo skin, which I do too, so I feel like I can relate to this one, which I love. Let's see the ingredients real quick. Okay, water, sorbitol, uh, Campbell. Let's see. Hope there's no fragrance because I'm just gonna be turned off automatically. Okay, there's no fragrance. Hyaluronic acid. Okay, vitamin E, chlorpheniston, which is a preservative booster. Okay, so the ingredients look pretty good. I don't see anything that you should be worried about with this cleanser, so I will recommend it, I guess. Um, but make sure that you know your skin and know what kind of skin you have. If you maybe have dry skin, maybe this wouldn't be the right one for you. So my next step is a face mask, and I love to do if i have time i will alternate three different face masks even in one night this is the caudalie instant detox mask this is one of my favorites i just alternate masks depending on what my skin needs i have always been into masks um my skin can break out very easily you know it's important to me to use products um, that are as clean as possible chloe taught me this trick to put on your neck to put everything going upwards. She just used the Caudalie mask and I looked it up. Um, it has some ingredients that I do want to point out on it. It has benzoyl alcohol, which benzoyl alcohol is, I know it sounds like it's an alcohol and for those with dry skin, you might be worried about and then your skin getting dried out, but it really is 
a fatty alcohol, so it's non-drying. It can actually be in emollients and serve as a skin softener. If you are uh, sensitive to benzoyl alcohol, I will advise not to use this mask. Other than that, it is safe to use in all skin types. So if you're oily, dry, uh, combo skin, this is safe for you to use. It is a clean product at Sephora, so it's formulated without SLES, so parabens, formaldehyde. So if you're concerned about the parabens and you know the rest of all the ingredients that are sort of controversial in the market i will say that this is fairly safe to use while i have this mask on i'm not just going to sit here and watch the mask dry so while i'm doing my entire skin routine i sip on our poosh and vital proteins pink moon milk which is collagen um, i firmly believe in beauty from the inside out so gonna put me to sleep too. How drinking collagen? I, I just laughed because this just seems like a push, uh, a push sales pitch. I mean, I'm here for it, girl. You know, get your coins, get your coins. I'm here for it. But girl, like it's so obvious that she's trying to push, push, okur, push, push bars. No, okay, never mind. Um, but no, you don't need to be drinking collagen, whatever drink, or was it a smoothie or something? You don't need to be drinking that. You can literally get collagen from eating, you know, your vegetables and eating foods that have collagen in them. Your skin actually does produce collagen. It is produced in the dermis of our skin. We produce collagen, elastin, and hyaluronic acid in the dermis layer of our skin. So you do produce it. So it's not something that your skin is like dying for, especially for a younger person. If you're a little older, definitely you know take steps towards eating protein to get you know your collagen levels up but you don't really need to go out and get like a drink that has collagen in it it's just a sales pitch you guys all right moving on i love to put on a lip balm and i love this barbara sturm lip balm it's very smooth it's definitely one of my favorites the so barbara sturm lip scrub she used is freaking 55 dollars you guys you don't need to spend 55 dollars on a lip scrub there's tons of other affordable options that are in the market, so definitely don't feel the need to spend that much on the lip scrub. Even looking at the ingredients here, there's nothing amazing about it. I mean, it has beeswax, which is in every other lip scrub, seed butter, oil. I mean, there's nothing amazing in the lip scrub that I feel like I need to spend that much for, so absolutely not. So this step I probably do about three times a week. This is our... Aura and Push Hyaluronic Halo with CBD. So it's hyaluronic acid, vitamin C, and CBD. And it's a serum. And we spent probably, I mean, months and months creating this. And I put the serum on first, which I put the serum on nightly, but I only do the derma roller three times a week. Again, you go up. Chloe's trick. I always put every product on my hands and chest as well. The serum that she used, so it's a collaboration between her and Hora Skincare. It has vitamin C, hyaluronic acid, CBD, uh, vitamin B3. You guys, I'm not gonna lie, I haven't done a lot of research about CBD, but I have taken CBD. It really helps with just like soothing and relieving you of anxiety and stuff. As far as it on the skin, I don't know how it performs, so I'm not gonna speak too much on it. I've heard really good things about it. Hyaluronic acid is always great. Vitamin B3 and vitamin C is great. Honestly, the only thing that I would say, how much is this product anyway? $50? A little on the high side. It's not overly expensive, but it is on the high side. If you care that much about CBD veneer skincare product, definitely go out and get this, but it's not something that I'm like crazy about. It seems like a good serum. If Axis is something that you love, definitely give this product a try. I soak in rubbing alcohol for at least 10 minutes after the last time I use it, and then I rinse it. So this is teeny, teeny, tiny little needles. Then I roll, so I go like five times in one area, and side to side. And this builds collagen. It's really helped with my skin's texture and tone, and it really gets the product into your skin. So it just takes any products that you're using to the next level, and it can help lighten any dark spots, which I definitely get sunspots because I was in Italy all summer and you can only have so much sunscreen and hats. 
So after derma rolling, do not forget to put it into rubbing alcohol. I love that she's just casually using derma roller, like it doesn't hurt. If you guys watched my video on my skincare routine, you guys knew that I was dying using the derma roller. It hurts. Ow! It's literally tiny little needles on your face. This girl's a gangster. That's how I know she's a gangster because it hurts. It's, she's just like there, like, mm -hmm. Then again, corny is super monotone, so I'm not surprised. But yeah, derma roller is amazing. It helps in product penetration. It helps with fine lines. It helps get rid of acne spots. It's just an overall great product. I love how she's casually like, I was in Italy all summer. Wouldn't that be the life? That we already love? <laughs> One day. But yeah, derma roller is definitely an amazing, amazing product. It's a very, very inexpensive product to have. So it just helps seep all this product into your skin as well as um, help with fine lines and wrinkles. And it really helps at least the fine lines and wrinkles in my forehead over time. I love the Dermarola, live for Dermarola. Then I take the serum one more time and then it really goes in there. The serum is so healing. It's one of my favorite products, probably my favorite. And for those of you who don't know, we named Poosh after my daughter Penelope. Um, that's her nickname that we've had for her for years. And she loves to give me facials. And, you know, she is, you know, I think she's watched me for her whole life with um, taking care of my skin. And, you know, we do get hair and makeup done almost every day for filming the show. So I think she's really seen that you know her whole life i think my mom has always instilled in us um self-care and taking care of ourselves and always taught us you know just from young kids when you get out of the shower you put on lotion okay you guys i'm just gonna end the video here because i mean she's pretty much done doing her skincare she's just talking about like you know other things now so anyways the last product that she used is dr sturm's face moisturizer you guys this product is 205 dollars Who's gonna spend that much on a skincare product? That's just absolutely wild. And just looking here at the active ingredients, it's vera seed oil, porcelain, benthanol, bisabol, which is an amazing ingredient. So it's long oil, vitamin E, ginger root. I mean, granted, great active ingredients, but not worth $205. Are you guys kidding? Wow, I mean, it's Courtney, of course. I'm sure she didn't even pay for this. So if you're struggling, financially, then go out there and spend all your heart and coins on this expensive products. There's definitely cheaper alternatives that I've mentioned throughout uh, my videos and even just on my own personal skincare routine videos. All right, y'all, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, her skincare routine is pretty simple. Skin looks great for a 47 year old woman. I mean, I hope to only look like her at that age. Yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. That's it for today. Leave a comment below uh, what your favorite part of her skincare was. What is your go-to skincare moisturizer and sunscreen? I personally love using Super Goop sunscreen uh, for every day. I just love it. It's my to-go sunscreen. Thank you guys so much for watching. Subscribe if you haven't. Leave a like if you like this video. It'll help me make more and encourage me to make more. I'll see you guys next time. Bye.